English for Year 6, Teaching Week 36, Date 8 of May 2020. Topic on Comprehension Questions. Hello children, welcome back to video 10. How's everyone at home? What are you all doing? Have you done the essay? <laughs> okay, if you have not, no worries. Take your time. Plan out when you should do your homework. Okay, right. Moving on to today's lesson. I want you to open up your workbook. Page uh, 54. Okay, sorry. I have to close some of the answers because this time I'm not going to give you the free answers. I want you to try to answer these questions. Okay, in the previous page, uh, I've asked you to answer about, if I'm not mistaken, four questions. And that's quite direct questions. So, moving on to question, uh, which is A, 10, and part B, question 2. These are the three questions that I want you to answer. Sorry if you can see my shadow. I'm trying to block myself. <laughs> okay. Uh, okay, these three questions allows you to think a little bit deeper. Uh, what sort of question it is and how do you supposed to answer? How are you supposed to answer? Alright, okay, look at the first, I mean, question number 8. Mention two ways in which contributions could be made to the Golden Heart Fund. So, I hope you would have, I mean, if you, I hope you can remember the newspaper report, which is on your textbook, um, page 58. Okay, this part, 35,000 rays for needy children. So I believe you understand the report, which is, um, uh, what is the reason, why this, why did they come up with, why did this organizing uh, team uh, organize this funfair? What is the reason? Uh, how can you donate? Uh, there are these type, there are answers given in this report. So, from this question, there are two ways contribution can be made to the golden heart so how okay how tell the ways okay moving on to question number 10 people uh, sorry will people who make donations by phone have to pay call charges i mean people who make donations by phone okay when they're using the phone do they have to pay the call charges okay Give a reason for your answer. Why do you think so? Is it a yes? And why? If it's a no, why? Okay. Moving on to part B question. Okay. Read both newspaper reports on page 57 to 59 of the textbook. That means there's two reports. Okay. Remember? This one, Memories of Hard Times Prompt 1.5 Million Donation. And this report as well. Okay. Then, answer the following questions in complete sentences. You not you don't have to answer question 1. You need the question number 2. Okay. Besides informing the readers about events taking place, what other purpose could the newspaper have for publishing this report? Give evidence to support your answer. Besides informing the readers about events taking place, okay? You see, the newspaper, what is the function of a newspaper? To give information to the readers, correct? So, it's asking him this question. It says, besides telling readers about events, I mean, events in such, as in, in a, for example, it's like this, the fun fair, maybe there'll be a road show, okay? Be besides doing all these kind of things, what other purpose could the newspaper have for publishing this report? Give evidence. What are the purpose? So think a little bit and try to answer. Okay, children? Okay, that's about it in this lesson. I'll see you in the next video. Take care. Bye.